My name is Eric Broderson. I'm the president of k &E Plastics, located in Bennington, Vermont. We are a contract manufacturer of machined plastic parts. One of the things that uh, k &E Plastics has always done uh, since inception, one of the things that kind of separates us from, from our competition is the fact that one, we have 50 years of experience in machining plastics. Um, a lot of companies have a difficult time saying that. Um, and the other thing that has always been true for us is we've never deviated from that. We don't have part of the shop machining metal and part of the shop machining plastics. We are specific to just machining those plastic materials. We started to notice a change with some of our customers in providing us with tighter tolerances, better finishes, and so forth with the materials. And so we had to start to work with different tooling manufacturers, different feeds, speeds, programming processes, and so forth to look at that challenge and try and figure out what was going to be the best approach for us to provide what the customers were looking for. During that process, we came across RegoFix. And with RegoFix, the tooling presented multiple facets to us that we liked, revolving around the uh, runout of the tooling, the TIR. With that runout being a, an improvement over our traditional tooling, which was standard Cat 40 tool holders, our runout was, was uh, within about two to three thousandths. And because of that, it caused burrs in the parts it caused us to have greater tolerances required in the machining process. When we went with RegoFix, we really noticed a change in the tolerances that we could hold, the burrs that we were generating, and those two facets then played into other benefits for us as well. The other factor that we saw was in regards to our tool wear. With the runout that we used to have with our standard collet tooling, a lot of the times we weren't using all the flutes on a cutter because of the runout. Now with the RegoFix tooling, the runout is, is minimal to where now we're cutting with all surfaces of the cutter, which is improving the cycle time and it's also improving the life of the tools that we use. When we looked at some of the other uh, competitors out there, one of the other ones that we looked at was the heat shrink fit tooling. And what we didn't like was the fact that you're taking a metal tool holder and you're heating and cooling and heating and cooling. Over time, it reduces the life of that tool holder, where with RegoFix, we didn't have to worry about that. Uh, as far as growth, we were experiencing a lot of growth. It really started about a year ago for us. Um, we are continuing to see the growth with new, uh, new products, with existing and new customers. We are uh, looking to expand and continue to fill the shop floor. We're at about 70% uh, capacity right now, so we, we are looking for about 30% more growth in the company. And we're expecting that probably over the next three years.